Hello and good evening. In this video, I'm going to be reviewing the book Fallen Angel by Heather Terrell. Now, this book I actually read as an ebook on my Kindle right here. That's why I showed you the paper picture of it so you can see the actual cover. I finished this book today and I'm very excited to review it. Okay, for those of you that haven't heard about this book, I will read to you the description of it. Ellie was never particularly good at talking to boys or anyone other than her best friend and fellow outcast, Ruth. Then she met Michael. Michael is handsome, charming, sweet and totally into Ellie. It's no wonder she is instantly drawn to him. But Michael has a secret and he knows Ellie is hiding something too. They've both discovered they have powers beyond their imagining. Powers that are otherworldly. Ellie and Michael are determined to uncover what they are and how they got this way together. But the truth has repercussions neither could have imagined. Soon they find themselves centre stage in an ancient conflict that threatens to destroy everything they love. And it is no longer clear whether Ellie and Michael will choose the same side. I actually really love this book. It's pretty awesome. And the chapters are nice and short as well is pretty cool and I liked the relationship between Ellie and Michael like the romance and everything was there like paranormal romance throughout the story Ellie and Michael go through tasks where they try to discover who they are what they are and their family background and how they're related etc etc the ending is quite gripping and it sort of leaves you hanging in you wanting there to be another book which goes further um, which there actually is um, a sequel to this which I'm looking forward to reading actually a lot more about Ellie and Michael and their relationship and everything so that seems pretty snazzy so I should go on to reading that at some point I would actually recommend this book for people to read, especially if you are into the sort of paranormal romance, angels, nephilim, vampires and, and all that sort of stuff. It, there's a lot of that going on in this, so it's pretty cool. And, well, and also it has a very nice snazzy cover to it. That's pretty cool. I would give this story probably four, four and a half stars. Um, it didn't really hook me like I thought it would, but I still really liked it and really enjoyed it. And all the characters and, and the storyline and everything. So, that is why. And that is the end of my review. So, please look out for the next two books that I will be reviewing soon, which is The Blood Keeper by Tessa Grattan and Vicky Schultz. So, yeah, thanks for watching, as always.